My name is Yu Chengyuan. This study is titled Modeling Information-Based Academic Writing, a domain analysis focusing on the knowledge dimension. In this era of information explosion, information literacy is important in academic writing, and the researchers have pointed out the necessity of incorporating information literacy in integrated writing assessment. This study reports on part of a domain analysis study for an information-based academic writing assessment and focuses on the knowledge dimension. It can be necessary to take a look at previous conceptual work on information-based academic writing. This figure shows a three-dimensional model that defines information-based academic writing as social, cognitive, metacognitive, and affective. In the cognitive dimension, while knowledge plays an important role in generating new knowledge, shapes information behavior, and is represented in writing, this model describes knowledge only in two broad aspects which are linguistic and context. Therefore, it can be necessary to hear from stakeholders' voice to gain a fine-grained understanding of the knowledge dimension. To address the above-mentioned research purpose, this study interviewed four groups of stakeholders, writing experts, information specialists, content instructors, and students. Instructors and graduate students in one discipline were selected because relevant constructs, which are information literacy and academic writing, are discipline-specific constructs, which means different disciplines may have different expectations for information-based academic writing. Semi-structured interviews were conducted to gain the insider's experience and views. The interviews were transcribed verbatim and coded in two cycles. In the first cycle, the researcher identified expressions related to knowledge. In the second cycle, the first cycle codes were categorized into larger categories. The coding process was iterative and reflexive. Three types of knowledge were identified. The first is knowledge of the discipline and this type has two subcategories. Explicit one that includes, for example, content knowledge and tacit knowledge that includes, for example, evaluative judgments of appropriate information sources and good writing. The second type is knowledge of the information environment which includes knowledge of available academic resources and information tools in their context. The third type is knowledge of language. Language is important for both the writing process and the information literacy process. The writer needs the content knowledge to search for information and put in their writing, and also need to construct themselves, engage with and guide readers with meta discourse markers. The findings make concrete the knowledge specified in foregoing literature. By further describing context as disciplinary and informational and relating the context to the individual cognitive dimension. Based on the findings of this study, I argue that information-based academic writing should be situated in specific disciplines to incorporate disciplinary practice, be related to content and convention, be situated in specific information context, assess both propositional and meta-discursive dimensions of language, and finally, assess language use through the multitude of information-based academic writing process. That's all for my presentation. Thank you for your attention.